seriously? I'm gonna make her do it. It's I'm it's really hot. My butt it off. is really hot today. Uh, and before we get started back in the garden, we were gonna come up here to the barn and play around a little bit. Miss Corey wants a shelf, and we are working on some different designs and whatnot for our uh, retail stand and and for you know stuff I like to do to make and sell stuff. And so she gets lucky because I can guinea pig all the stuff and she gets to keep the guinea pig stuff. And actually this is her project and I'm just helping her do it. Uh, but she wanted a little shelf, kind of the shelf with the piece behind it that she can put her little knobs, in it. knobs on and hang stuff on. So that's what we're gonna work on today. It's gonna be a really simple design. Uh, round it up just a piece of white oak. You can see it started getting planed and it's gonna be really pretty. So we're gonna finish planing this piece of white oak and then we'll get started making a uh, little shelf. Since uh, we'll probably be joining these two pieces, uh, we're gonna go ahead, so we got these plain, I'm gonna set the table saw up, and we're gonna run these through the table saw before we do any cutting so that we have nice square edges. So, we'll get that done.
you and this with this guy, you can keep your hands completely away from everything. All you're gonna do is hold it here, so your hands are away, and you're just gonna move it up until you come right at the edge of the line. And that's why, like when I did that, I started over. So start cutting a little bit further, and then you can come back and move it just a little bit. Always start to overshoot. <laughs> And then all you're going to do is just, but you got to make sure, but make sure all the time. Here. Yeah, I know. I'll just show you. Okay. Just make sure you don't let it kick back or forth. Just hold. You need to hold it. See, that's actually what this is for. So you can hold this piece here. So go ahead and get it lined up about where you want. I would, I would hold it like this, so that you can hold it. With everything, you know, you can't... Oh, with the handle? And then hold it with the handle, and then just push the handle and pull back. What are you doing? that far from to here. This is to attach because the shelf is going to go on top of this so this will attach. Just do one and then do one and then we'll do uh, one. That'll hold it while we put in or put the uh,
everybody so this is the finished product and you saw we stopped it I had the knobs different we wanted to do burn the knobs a little bit uh, different I changed the spacing but I think it turned out pretty good we'll uh, take it over here in the light where you can see it and we just did a spar urethane and finished it with the torch like you saw because that's some I like and the oak does lend itself a lot better to being torched than say the poplar because the grain on the oak is so tight and where like knot holes and stuff are it really really looks cool so something for you guys to look if you saw how i made that really simple um very simple to make and definitely will do the job so now miss corey's gonna put that in the bedroom or behind the door i have somewhere for me to put clutter because that's what I do <laughs> and uh, yeah so make sure and like subscribe and share because we got a lot more building stuff coming up uh, some little projects and whatnot and thanks for watching